carbon capture in the steel industry shows great potential for reducing the carbon footprint of these plants. Therefore, a test facility was installed here at the first Alpina Steel Mill in Linz to prove this promising technology and to investigate optimization potential. The system consists of a flue gas pretreatment to reduce the gas temperature and to remove impurities, which could influence the operation of the CO2 removal process. Afterwards, the flue gas is entering the CO2 absorption column. There, a special liquid catches the CO2 and releases it again in the desorption column by means of heat input. Now, the regenerated liquid is sent back to the absorber, where it can catch CO2 again. With this process, more than 90% of the emitting CO2 can be captured and stored in liquefied forming gas bundles. Then this pure CO2 can be used for further utilization or stored underground to remove it permanently from the atmosphere. We see the carbon capture technology as a major solution in the worldwide decarbonization strategies. Especially in industries like iron and steel, Western energy, cement or any other industry which simply cannot easily avoid their greenhouse gas emissions, we as Andritz want to help our customers with sustainable solutions. And for this, to show the carbon capture technology, we have installed this test plant in a steel mill. We at K1 Met are a metallurgical competence center. We support our industrial partners on their way towards climate neutrality. Therefore, we demonstrate CO2 reduction technologies like this Amine scrubber. The role of K1 Met is the optimization of this Amine scrubber under real condition, which purifies CO2 for further processing. The energy needed, or the main energy needed in this process, is the heating of the solvents. Therefore, it is particularly important to us to test different solvents to keep the energy input as low as possible.